Hello, what's up? Ali here, and uh, today we are going to show you how to extract multiple files and install games with multiple patch, DLC, fix, like Modern Warfare 2. On this video, we are going to need either a WinRAR or a 7-zip. I will just leave a link on our description, just open the link, and it will take you to this website. For the 7-zip, just look for your system and download the right application. Since I am using a 64-bit Windows, this is what I need, so I will just click on this link to download the file and now for the WinRAR simply click on this part basically WinRAR is already part of the default applications when you reinstall your Windows but in case you don't find it anywhere you just go ahead and re-download this application to install the application, just double click and install. Same goes for the WinRAR, just double click and install. Now to extract multiple files, say for example this Modern Warfare, you don't have to extract each part. All you have to do is right click on the first part and extract. Personally, I use WinRAR since it is easier to navigate using WinRAR. You can just go ahead and right click either extract here or extract under folder or extract file to be able to choose a folder where you want to extract the game or the file or you can simply right click and drag the file on a folder where you want to extract it say for example i will just go ahead and extract this game to the compressed folder so right click drag it here then extract here then all of these files will be extracted in this folder along with all of its parts you don't have to extract each and every file all you have to do is look for the first part and extract that file if you want to use 7-zip it is just basically the same process just right click and you can extract it here or on a specific folder you can also drag and drop it on a specific folder using right click choose 7-zip and extract here if you have 7-zip you don't need the WinRAR same goes for the WinRAR if you have WinRAR you don't need the 7-zip after the extractions all of the parts will be automatically be merged now to install a game with multiple patch in DLC the very first thing that we have to secure is every part should have the same region here for example the Modern Warfare 2 this is the base game and the region is this Title ID COCA34029. So every part of this base game should have the same region. To be able to check the FPK key, we are going to need an application called the PS4 PKG Viewer. You will find the link on our description. Just open the link and click on this part to download this application. You don't have to install this. All you have to do is download, extract the file. You can go ahead and delete the file once you have extracted it. Open the folder and open this application. You can also use that as a default application when you open an FPKG. So just right click on the FPKG, click on open with, choose another app, choose more apps, look for another app on this PC. And locate the application. That way you will be able to open your FPKG and view them. So let us go ahead and check the other parts of this game. For the backport, for the update, you will notice that they are within the same region or title ID. Same goes to all of the parts. Now if you install multiple parts game, Check your FBKG and verify if they have the same title ID. Now for the game like Modern Warfare 2, because this is quite a tricky game to install, make sure you have all of these parts present to be able to get the game working. You should have the base game, the back port or the update, the DLC, to be specific, they are the campaign pack 1, pack 2, co-op pack DLC, multiplayer pack, Warzone and the campaign licenses. 
all six of them. So in total, there should be 13 FPKGs. You should install everything to be able to get this to work. And it is also advisable to install them on this order. First is the base game. Next is the update. Then the DLC. Last are the licenses. Now let us go ahead and uh, try this on our PS4. To install the game, make sure that they are placed on the root of the hard drive. Go to the package installer and make sure your PS4 can detect all of the files. If your PS4 could not detect your external hard drive, make sure that it is formatted to XFAT or just simply install your games directly from PC. If you need a complete and detailed guide on how to install games directly from PC, I will just leave a link on our description of a video on how to do that. Now let us go ahead and install all. And now before we try the game, let us go ahead and check the information first. Press Option and Information. Make sure that the version is above 1.0. Right now we have 1.08. That means that we have successfully installed the update. And for the add-ons, make sure you have all of this as well. Now let us go ahead and try the game. And if ever you are stuck on this part, just simply smash on go offline. After this, you may go ahead and choose your mode. Gold Eagle Actual Shadow One is weapons hot. We're burning daylight here. Watch your one to Bravo Zero Seven. You in position? Nearly there. All right. Go hell you coming. Single player campaign is good. Now let's go ahead and check our offline multiplayer. Alright, so um, local multiplayer is also good. When installing the game, just make sure that all of the parts have the same region or same title ID. And make sure you have included all of the DLC and licenses. If you are getting some errors with the installation itself on the PS4, that means that you may have some issues with the hard drive. So simply use a different hard drive or install the game directly from the PC. So this will be it for now. In case you still have some questions or suggestions or you have encountered some issues or errors that we have failed to discuss, please go ahead and share them on our comment section and I will definitely address them. And again, my name is Ali. If you found this video helpful, please go ahead and like and subscribe and I will definitely see you on our next video. Bye-bye.